हेलो ऑल वेलकम टू वी एल एस आई ड्रिलिंग चैनल लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब फॉर न्यू लर्निंग्स इन दिस वीडियो टूडे वी विल बी लर्निंग अबाउट पैक्ड वर्सेस अनपैक्ड अरेज इन सिस्टम वेरी लॉग सो गेट सेट एंड गो पैक्ड अरेज इन सिस्टम वेरी लॉग अ पैक्ड अरे इज एन अरे whose elements are stored in a contiguous block of memory system verilog uses the term packed array to refer to the dimensions declared before the object name if we see this example logic 7 down to 0 packed underscore array 10 so here we are declaring a packed array of size 10 where each element is an 8 bit logic vector Let us see another example for packed array bit 2 down to 0 7 down to 0 mem so here after mem nothing is specified so it means 0 this means that single row of the memory location and 7 down to 0 means each element is of 8 bit and second dimension 2 down to 0 means that those 8 elements are replicated 3 times so this represents efficient use of memory because all the bits are placed back to back without any gaps now let us see what are unpacked arrays in system verilog an unpacked array is an array whose elements can be accessed individually the term unpacked array is used to refer to the dimensions declared after the object name Let us see this example. Int my underscore array ten. So here we are declaring an unpacked array of size ten. Unpacked arrays can be declared as arrays of any data type, such as bit, integer, byte, or struct. For example, bit seven down to zero mem eight. So here. after mem 8 is written which means depth of the memory is of 8 size while each element is of 8 bit here we can see there are lots of unused bits because those 8 bit elements are placed non contiguously so this means each element in an unpacked array is stored in a separate memory location and the size of an unpacked array is determined by the number of elements it contains like we saw in the previous example hence it requires more use of memory as compared to the packed arrays let us see packed versus unpacked array differences in a nutshell so for packed array data is stored in a contiguous block of memory while for unpacked array data is stored separately in its own block of memory for packed arrays they are used to represent bus oriented signals which can be packed into a smaller number of bits while for unpacked arrays they can represent large data sets or arrays of variables with varying sizes for packed array syntax we have to specify packed keyword before the data type and dimensions of the array however for unpacked array if we do not declare anything packed then it will by default take it as unpacked type of array packed arrays support bit level operations while unpacked arrays do not support bit level operations for packed arrays we can use dollar bits system function to determine size of the array in bits while for unpacked arrays we can use dollar dimension system function to determine size of each dimension of array packed arrays they allow efficient use of memory while unpacked arrays they require more use of memory so keep learning to keep rocking hope you all enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos thank you so much